Now may I invite our dear friend, Mr. Matan Van Habat, member of the House Representative, to say a few words for us. Madam Representative, people of Taiwan, friends of Taiwan, uh, thanks for inviting my colleagues and the me here on this uh, special occasion. And the first thing, of course, I have to say is congratulations with the birthday. Thank congratulations. You. Yeah. 108 years old. That sounds very old for a country that is maybe not so old. Um, but see what the Republic of China, what Taiwan has reached in those 108 years. And not only economically, but also about other values, about human rights, uh, about, about diversity of people. And that's great. In the Netherlands, we don't have such a day, a birthday. We we'll have to go back in the 17th century when um, a war was over with some signs on paper. And that's the birth of what the Netherlands is now. But we did much more years about reaching the same thing you did in 108 years, because you mentioned the VOC in Formosa. But when we entered Formosa in those years, we were not as tolerant as we are now, as you are now. So we did much more longer to reach what you did in 108 years. We're both small countries. And we have to deal with the ideas, the acts, the grills, and the twitters of large countries. And we have to try to reach our goals and to reach values that are important and we share those values through those large entities. And that is also the reason why my colleague Mr. Bishop from the Reform Party he couldn't be here today, but he really wanted to be here because he's also a real friend of Taiwan. And he had the idea and invited me to share the idea to drop the resolution on Taiwan and to ask or to demand our government to seek for possibilities where Taiwan can act in international organizations. And yes, thank you. And actually, now we're here at the birthday, so we can say some nice things, of course, for instance, about Mr. Bishop. He's a very good colleague of mine. I don't know if there are some Catholics here in the, in the room. Mr. Bishop is reformed, but I'm a Catholic boy from the south of the Netherlands. And when you drop a resolution with two persons, you always got the first name first, and then the second name, of course. And so the re resolution on Taiwan is called Resolution Bishop van Helbert. <laughs> so that's really great for Catholic boys. And after that, I saw it was about Taiwan. No, no, that's a good joke. But it was really, really great. And um, it was um, adopted, and also the minister said, it's a difficult, it's a difficult resolution, of course. Because it's not easy. China is not easy. And he said, but when we try to do, to reach it, together with other European countries, we can make a difference. And I think that's very important. And because of the resolution is adopted yesterday, we can ask our minister, all our colleagues, can ask our minister, what did you do this week for the Republic of China? What did you do this week for the situation on Taiwan? And that's really great. And that's Nearby, of course, the 108th birthday, I think, worth a congrats. So, also, congrats on that. Thank you very much.